So I'm in the Myriad in Anaheim. I'm about to enter Reef of Palooza. So let's go. Welcome to Aquarium Thoughts. I'm Dave. Today I'm at Reef of Palooza. Check it out. Yeah, I'm normally into fish, uh, freshwater fish, but this is a saltwater convention. So let's go ahead and check it out and see what's here. So let me go ahead and show you a few things I actually picked up from Reef of Palooza in Anaheim. Now of course this is the swag. Uh, what swag is, is basically stuff that companies hand out uh, pretty much as promotion to give out samples. Uh, basically also a form of advertisement as now you can see I'm doing a video on some of this stuff. So let's go ahead and show you what swag I got during Reef of Palooza 2019. Um, I did stop by the Reef Nutrition booth and I picked up some ROE, which is real oceanic eggs, food for fish and invertebrates. I'm going to try this in my freshwater and see how it does. Uh, they did mention that it'll, it, freshwater will eat it as well, so I'm going to go ahead and try that. They do keep it in RODI water, so it's not going to be a worry on in terms of salt. Another thing I received from them was trigger pods, which are live copepods. So I got a bottle of live copepods right here, and you can actually see them on that side if it's focusing. I don't know if it's focusing, but you can see them moving around. Or it could just be because I'm moving the bottle, I don't know which. But <laughs> And another thing I picked was RG Complete, which is food for rotifers, copepods, and brine shrimp. Uh, basically, super concentrated marine microalgal feed and enrichment. So, what I'm going to try with this is I'm going to try this in my Daphnia cultures just to see how it does. Uh, they were nice enough to give me the sample, and I will actually do a video on that and give you the results. So, I have that. Uh, other things I did receive was I did receive a Marine Depot sticker. Reef Nutrition stickers and some other stickers like from Kessel. Um, I also received some um, coral glue guns. Uh, this is one set I got, which they actually gave me a refill along with the uh, gun. Uh, this was from Spinning a Wheel at uh, one of the booths. Um, I forget which, but when I remember, I'm going to put it right down below right here. Uh, so this was one booth. Uh, that my son actually spun spun the wheel and he actually landed on the glue gun. So we got that, and we also got another glue gun as well. This was at a different booth, uh, basically from Mac, Mac, Mac Spec, which is what this gun is for, from, and basically that one had a, like a little button and you had to stop it between, it was a timer that ran, it, you had to stop it between 9.9 .9 and 10.1, and I actually stopped it at 9.96. So I got lucky on that one, and I actually got two of them. 
And actually on this video, if you stay till the end, I will give you a code to put in the comments below. And I'm actually gonna give one of these away to one lucky winner out there. And yes, I will be picking the winner at random from those people who leave that comment down below. So, stay until the end of the video and I'll give you that code to put in the comments. And you can be the proud winner of this. Uh, also keep in mind, I will also probably see if I can get, put any other goodies into that giveaway box. So it's not just the core of glue gun. Uh, but this should also work on fresh water if you're doing a planet tank, if you have to glue stuff to logs like Anubius or Java Fern. Um, I will have de yeah, Sion Crylate Gel Glue, which is basically super glue, if I'm not mistaken. Please correct me if I'm wrong in the comments below. I'll probably Google that later. Um, and also, I did receive some things from Fritz. I stopped by the Fritz uh, booth and I was actually able to pick up a bottle of their uh, Fritz glass and acrylic cleaner. So I got a bottle of that as well as they also gave me to try out uh, something new which is Fritz Sea Greens, which is right there. I'm gonna go see if uh, my bristle nose would eat it or my uh, Florida flag fish that's in my outside tank. If not, my snails in my tanks will definitely munch down on this green algae. I probably have a few other fish that will probably chow down on this. I'm probably gonna try that out tomorrow. Um, also, another thing I did receive uh, there was from a um, local fish store. They had a booth set up. Uh, this was uh, from Age of Aquariums, which is in Signal Hill, kind of by Long Beach, California. They're handing out a sticker and some other things in here. I don't know exactly what's all in here, uh, but I will open this up later and find out what's, what was in there. So far, I do want to give a, a huge thanks out to Fritz. They're awesome there. Uh, I, I'm ha very happy to have these to try out, as well as Reef Nutrition for actually handing out some samples of that stuff. Um, I did receive another sea veggies, which is red seaweed. Uh, this will probably be good as well for my algae eating or vegetable eating fish that I have. And this is Julian Springs or Sprung's Sea Veggies. I don't know if that's a spring or a sprung just by the cursive on it. Uh, it's from Two Little Fishies, it's Aquarian Foods. Uh, thank you to whatever booth was handing this out. Um, and also I did get some other foods from Fluval. I got some samples of bug bites. They're always really good at handing out samples at these events. Good place to pick up bug bites if you need them. Um, and then also got, also from Reef Nutrition, I got some more food, which is another sample of TDO Chroma Boost. Uh, this will be good for my freshwater fish as well. I know this was a saltwater convention, but a lot of the stuff will work on the freshwater side as well. Uh, some more than others, but Anything that I get that's strictly for saltwater, I do have a friend at work that does have a saltwater tank and I'm probably gonna give him some stuff as well. I also got a piece of driftwood and also another sample of some pellets from Ocean Nutri uh, Nutrition. This is just a small little pellet, uh, pellet, a small little container of pellets from them, the F2 MD, medi oh, I'm guessing that's medium pellets, so I have that as well. So that is the swag I got besides uh, a couple t-shirts and these bags. So let's go ahead and see what I got. Later on I do have some purchases to show you off as well as something I won. So if you want to see what I won, stay close to the end as well as if you want to enter the gift giveaway for this coral glue gun.
now moving on to stuff I actually purchased. Uh, this I got from Flipper. Uh, same people who brought you the Flipper um, Magnet Algae Cleaner. This is a new scraper that they, they have. Uh, basically this is a small one for my Nano which I'm actually using for my little um, Shelly tank right down here. Uh, basically it was getting some algae on the window and I wanted to clean it off. So this I felt was going to be perfect. Uh, basically it's a little container where you can actually put like a credit card, a hotel key, anything in there. It does come with this little one right here, which as you can see, it does say flipper. There's two sides. I'm not quite sure what that part is. I'm probably going to have to read up on that and see what that's all about. But that does slide right in there and it's good for other things as well. Uh, now I kind of wish I probably would have uh, scoured the convention a little bit more. But later on, I did find a really, really interesting one from Fluval that I haven't seen before until I got there. But basically that was pretty neat as well. Okay, so moving on, a couple of things I did buy as well. Yeah, this is kind of a little bit hef heftier. Uh, this I bought for uh, the 16 gallon cube project I'm doing, which is gonna be part of one of my breeding projects that I'm gonna later expand on. But what I got there was some perfect rocks that will fit nicely into that and make a good aquascape in terms of rocks. I'm also going to have some plants in there, but this is going to this is going to be one rock that's going to be a basis in the middle of the tank, as well as not as heavy as that one, but this rock right here. I just saw these and know it. I I, I just like the way that they look. I think they're going to be they're going to be great in that tank. So I have that. And another thing I did buy is in this case. I really don't want to reveal what it is yet because I will be doing a upcoming video on this. In general just this project this product by itself so I'm gonna go ahead and keep that right there if you follow me on Instagram you will actually get see the picture of it I didn't really hide it on Instagram so if you do follow me there you will see what that actually is and you kind of get a little sneak peek of an upcoming video I will be doing so that is stuff I actually purchased I uh, got some good deals on these. Being a fish convention, they do kind of throw deals out there for these items. Uh Is if you stay within the coral boom ecosystem, though, you can use a single power supply, right? Right. And you can so, get rid of what I affectionately call cord creep <laughs> and get down to one power supply, right? Yeah. I mean, if we look inside my own aquarium cabinet, that looks like, you know, the, the bird's nest of cables. And <laughs> Who's that? <laughs> thing? <laughs> shady as it looks. All right. Here we go, folks. Pick me a winner. Boom! All right, here we go. 802 49 91. 802 49 91 going once, going twice. Now moving on forward, time to show you what I won. Uh, during the during the Reef of Palooza, they did have a raffle. Uh, for $20, you get 26 tickets to put in a variety of different prizes. Uh, there's 
a 90 gallon tank there, a 100 gallon tank there. Um, there were protein skimmers for, of course, the salt water tanks. I definitely did not put any raffle tickets in those because I really don't need that. Uh, there are some fluval canister filters. They had a couple of those. I did put tickets in those. Uh, there's some also some frag tanks, which I put tickets in there because I felt they would probably make a nice little tank for maybe a multi fasciitis Shelly tank, uh, basically because it's a little bit wider. I mean, yeah, the depth is not as high as this one, but Shelly's really kind of hang down towards the lower part of the tank, which I think that probably would have worked great. But let me go ahead and show you some of the stuff I did win um, on that. It was part of just one whole thing that I won. It was a kind of a package. Uh, basically, one of the things I got was Nutri-Diet Marine, Marine Flakes. It's a probiotic formula from Seachem. So I have that. Uh, this I might just give away to my co-worker at work who does have a saltwater tank. Um, although I'm, yeah, I'm guessing you could probably feed it to fresh water as well. So I will. If you if you know for, on that, please leave comments down below. I would like I would wonder if this would work for freshwater fish as well. I know this is a, a marine flake. I'm guessing it probably will be fine. Uh, another thing I did receive uh, that I did win is another thing from Seachem, of course, and this is Nutri Diet as well. This is uh, Chlor Chlor Chlorella flakes. Uh, da, 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 da. I don't know exactly what that is, but it is probiotics formula from Seachem. And this is actually stating that it is for marine or freshwater fish. So this I'm definitely going to keep because it will work with my food that I feed my fish. If you ever noticed my pepper mill shaker idea, well pepper mill, not a shaker, it's a pepper mill where I put a variety of foods in there and I grind them. Make sure you watch that video, you'll see how I feed my fish. And I also got some other bottles from, of course, Seachem. You can probably see a little theme going on. Of course, this is all stuff from Seachem that I won. Uh, this is Garlic Guard. I'm pretty sure you already know what this guy, this uh, package is. It's a garlic additive. It's a flavor enhancer for finicky eaters, freshwater or marine. So this is a nice little item that I picked up. I also received uh, Vitality, which is, of course, Seachem, uh, is a vitamin and amino acid supplement. So this specifically does state it is for marine fish. So you got that. Um, another bottle I did receive is also from Seachem, once again, it is Stress Guard which is reduces stress, antiseptic for fish, promote, promotes healing. And this one is for marine and freshwater, so this will actually work perfect for me. So that is what I won in the raffle. Well, part of it, because the next part right here is something else I did win, which is the Seachem Title 55, which is a hang on back filter uh, made by SICCE, uh, basically, it's a hang on back filter that you all should know about. It's something newer on the market. Uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and try this out. I haven't really figured out which tank this is gonna go on yet. Uh, I'm not quite sure if, cause I really don't use hang on back filters, but I figured out uh, I'll throw a raffle ticket in this one to see if I win it and lo and behold, I did. So that is what I won. And of course, if you wanna win something in my giveaway that I'm doing in this video, Leave a comment down below of the phrase that I'm going to give you at the end of this video. Anyways, thanks for watching my video on my trip to Rifa Palooza 2019 in Anaheim, located at the Marriott Hotel, down by the Anaheim Convention Center. 
Anyways, I also want to give thanks, uh, of course, to Fluval. I want to give thanks to Fritz. Uh, Reef Nutrition was awesome there as well. They were very helpful. Answer my questions in terms of will their stuff work with my freshwater tanks? Me being a freshwater person in the world of saltwater. Uh, overall, I think it was a great experience, even though it was a saltwater, and I really haven't delved into that rabbit hole yet. But another couple people I want to give thanks to for also letting me also include a clip of them speaking at the convention. I would like to give thanks to Mr. Jeff Johnston from Coral View, uh, which is this gentleman right here, his business card right there, as well as Peter Cherick. Cherick, I believe I'm probably butchering that last name, but I want to give thanks to him as well. He does the Reef News Network. I believe he's one of the co-hosts of that network. So I want to give thanks out to those two gentlemen for letting me actually insert the clip into this video right here that you've seen at some point during this long video on the Reef of Palooza in Anaheim that was held on August 18th. 2019. Well, it was also on t August 17th too, but I went on August 18th because I got that day off. Uh, now you're probably wondering when I'm going to give you that phrase to put in the comments to actually win the lovely coral glue gun. I hope people would love this. I'm doing a giveaway, so please in the comments below leave the magic keywords down below there and have a nice day. Keep on researching. Keep learn. Oh wait, you probably want the uh, key phrase. So down in the comments below, put glue me in the tank. Down in the comments below, uh, just glue me in the tank. That's all you have to leave in the comments. And you will be entered into win the coral glue gun. Now of course, unfortunately, I'm gonna have to restrict this to the lower 48 state. Yeah, lower 48 states in the United States. But if you do international, I will probably uh, also maybe throw in something else for the international. So if you're international as well, please go ahead and enter. Uh, it's probably going to be an Amazon gift card that I'm going to give to you. That way you can use that. Um, so, uh, And then if someone is international that wins, I will do another drawing uh, at another video to give this away again. So anyways, thanks for watching. If you haven't subscribed yet, make sure you hit that subscribe button, hit the bell notification, uh, share this video, like this video. Please help support this channel by doing those items and keep researching, keep learning, and have a nice day. Thank you.